It's fly day, and today I'm gonna share a really cracking buzzer pattern with you that's very effective for all you small still water anglers. It's the Karen buzzer. This buzzer, well, I came across it a few years ago, um, fishing in a small water international up at Chatton, um, and it was a pattern the Scottish team used very, very effective. Um, actually on practice day, not in match day, but they were doing really, really well. So after the match, you all get talking and you start sharing patterns. So this is what came out of it. Hence, it may not be called the Karen buzzer, but we called it the Karen buzzer. Now then, breathers in first. A lot of my buzzers don't have breathers, but this one does and uh, this is the original pattern and if it works don't mess with it so now it's going to get a bed of silk quite a slim pattern and tie these 12s 14s 16s if you fish or small waters that do a lot of catch and release and that and the fish start to become shy and this can be a really cracking pattern right get the mirage now and what we do we just roll it under the silk just get it in place right now then so just behind the thorax Just put a collar. Right now then. Trim both of that off and then just build up the thorax a little bit. Not too much. Don't want it massive. No cheeks on this one. That mirage is just enough. It's a trigger point. Then with the breathers, pull them back couple of turns in front so it just kicks them up making sure they haven't gone down the side that's it great and then just whip finish and then once you've finished two or three coats of varnish be very careful when you're applying the varnish because obviously you don't want the breathers to get wet you don't want that varnish to make them solid you want them to move a little bit then what we'll do now, we'll just make sure we don't want massive breathers. Just take it to there. There you go. Little breathers in front. Two or three coats of varnish. Job done. Karen buzzer. Simple, but very, very effective. Well, folks, I hope you enjoyed that flight. If you did, tell your mates so they can enjoy it as well. And don't forget, we've got loads more videos here on our YouTube channel covering all different types of flyers. We've got guest tires like that superstar Matthew Pate. Also, if you tie your own flies, do me a favor, send us a picture. You can post it on our Facebook page, HM Fly Fishing. You can also follow us on Twitter, HM Fly Fishing. And guess what? We're doing some stuff live as well on Periscope. See you again.